Audio Studios. It's the International Baccalaureate News Hour with Kenny Tam and Alex Salkin. Welcome. I'm Kenny Tam alongside Alex Salkin, and welcome to IB News. Today we're doing an in-depth investigative report on the IB Diploma Program at Field Township High School in Freehold, New Jersey. But first, Alex, many in our viewing audience may be unaware of what the Diploma Program is and what makes it such a special opportunity for college-bound students. What can you tell us about the IB Diploma Program? Well, Kenny, the IB Diploma Program was founded in 1968 as an academically challenging and balanced program that prepares students aged 16 to 19 for success at university and life beyond. It has been designed to address the intellectual, social, emotional, and physical well-being of students. What do you mean by addressing intellectual, emotional, and physical well-being of students? The program includes rigorous coursework in a broad range of subject areas, so it is intellectually enriching. In addition to taking classes in literature, language, science, math, history, and the arts, students take something called the core, which includes theory of knowledge, the extended essay, and CAS. Theory of knowledge fosters critical thinking skills and cross-curricular connections. The extended essay gives students the opportunity to do in-depth research on a topic of interest, and CAS helps students develop their passions and apply their knowledge by serving the community. It really does address the whole student. But what's the international part about? Well, IB is recognized globally by universities and employers, and there are over 3,000 schools in 147 countries around the world that offer the IB Diploma Program. Its mission is to develop inquiring, knowledgeable, and caring young people who help to create a better and more peaceful world through intercultural understanding and respect. Thank you for the report, Alex. Now that our audience better understands the IB Diploma Program, let's hear from our investigator in the field. From inside Freel Township High School, Cameron Schwartz. Thank you, Kenny. I'm currently standing outside of Freehill Township High School, one of the 16 diploma schools in New Jersey, and one of the 1,000 in the country. So joining IB is a great way to get a competitive edge when applying to colleges. Here at FDHS, the numbers don't lie. The first graduating class, the class of 2017, received over $8 million in scholarship offers and got into schools such as Vanderbilt, Duke, Johns Hopkins, and Cornell. Let's go inside to take a better look. I'm standing out, outside of Mr. Hipsley's TOK class. Let's ask him what he thinks about IB. So Mr. Hipsley, what do you think makes IB special? Uh, one of the things that makes IB special is the theory of knowledge course that all juniors and seniors take. The, uh, the interesting thing about theory of knowledge is that unlike some of the other classes, we're not really focused on so much learning things as examining how we learn, how we know what we claim to know, why we think we know things. And it can get into some really interesting, fascinating places going down that road. Mm -hmm. Why do you think students are so drawn to IB? Uh, because it's a, it's a comprehensive program. There's a lot of, of friendship and unity and a, and a sense of family amongst the students and the, the teachers and the advisors in the program. And it's a really tight-knit community. Ms. Kalinske, how would you say that IB history is different from other history classes available at FDHS? Well, it's a two-year course, which allows us to really take our time and dive deep into the content. Um, one really cool thing about History of the Americas is that we study not only U.S. history, but the history of Canada as well as South America. So that's definitely a, a unique history course that you can't find anywhere else in the curriculum here at FDHS. Um, because we can really take our time with the topics that we study, I find that the students who have such an insatiable thirst for learning and more knowledge, they're able to explore topics that they're most interested in, and um, we do a lot of research projects and presentations and a lot of hands-on learning. We look at different sources, and we have a lot of fun. Ms. Lanza, can yes. you tell me, how is IB literature different from other English courses? Well, um, just like IB as a whole, Cam, it's great because literature isn't taught in isolation, so we bring in a little history, psychology, um, philosophy, all of those fun things into the class as well. And instead of, say, an AP class where there's one test at the end which really determines your you know, success or failure in that class, there's a variety of assessments throughout uh, two years. And we are able to delve deeply into each one of the works, and the kids are assessed in all sorts of different ways. So we have everything from individual presentations to um, group presentations to writing and, and all sorts of different things. So it's a great opportunity for everybody to get to know one another and to really explore what literature means to them and uh, really how it fits into the world as a whole. 
My experience this year has really been really been great actually. It is a tough workload but I love challenging myself and the advice I have is just to not procrastinate and really work hard. Yeah, just to piggy off my uh, my brother Mikey here. Um, time management is huge in this program and it's really helped me learn and grow as a student and a, and a person in general. And it's kind of um, given me a light and a shed a light on what I really love to do and what I hope to um, do in later in the in the workforce and um, the teachers here are amazing they help you any way they can they want to they want you to do that what I really enjoy about history is the fact that I'm able to just debate with people and I'm really able to just you know clash with Annalise <laughs> honestly I <laughs> we have some pretty heated debates and I never really like cared about this stuff before joining IB but like I love just debating with people I love getting our opinions together and just like clashing with each other and changing people's minds and that's what I really enjoy about this history class to be honest. Like especially like with the way we do our debates like we're allowed to kind of say how we feel and there's like there are moments where like we switch sides and like it's really important how like you see how each of us shape each other and like we just did a debate on the Nagasaki and Hiroshima atomic bombing and like we tried three different styles and we got to like argue the side that we didn't really agree with and then we kind of did like a formal thing where we listened to the other side and then we asked questions and like it taught us to actually listen to people instead of just like yelling at them and saying like this is how it is and like you gotta believe it and like that's how real life goes so it was interesting to do that. But when I found out our school was getting IB I really liked the, the range of topics and how you really could do anything you want in IB in terms of subject area and what interests you and you could always find a way to incorporate that into projects and I really felt like I developed a better understanding of myself as a student and as a person as a result. So next year I plan on going to uh, UNC Chapel Hill and what I really love about IB is that I got to become really close to people that I never really knew before and I got to work together with them and work on projects and uh, presentations and stuff that I probably would have never done if I took honors classes or AP classes. And I think IB really prepared me well for going to a prestigious college and whatever I do in the future. In IB we have a lot of community of work. So we have this calendar where um, we post all of our assignments so our teachers know when we get, we'll have what assignments each day. So say we have like everyone has a math test one, math test one day and then another history teacher wants to put a history project we would put it on the calendar and they would be able to switch it over. IB really gives you a great time management because everyone is very communicative, everyone is very cooperative with everything, especially the teachers and especially the students who are helping everyone out. I think that IB has definitely taught us that hard work pays off and that we and all the bonds that we forged together, we've all essentially worked together and it's shown us that teamwork makes the dream work. It's a very collaborative and uh, thought-provoking program and the way we learn and the way we learn together as opposed to the way we learn as individuals. This has been Cameron Schwartz from Freehold Township. Back to you, Kenny. From all of us here at IB News, we want to thank you for joining us and wish you much success in deciding your pathway to college. We leave you with an aerial shot of beautiful Freehold Township High School and a parting message from the 2018 IB class.